keep these shoes outside because I don't want to get my trailer dirty. But every morning I have to make sure there aren't any spiders in there. I used to be afraid of those little fuckers, but I see them so much now. <laughs> Maybe I'm still a little scared. I don't think they're dangerous. They're the, see that one? Right there. They're harmless. Oh, Jesus. See? There they are. I feel like they're giving birth in there because there's like, so many. Like 20 in that little thing. So maybe they're laying eggs in my shoes. There's another one. Come on, bro. Now I got, uh, so this one started growing in. These are all dead. So the roots, uh, they don't go down, they grow, they go to the side. So I'm hoping these go this way because then it'll cover all this bullshit right here. These bullshit mailboxes, that bullshit sign right there. This bamboo, I'm hoping, will cover all of it. These are all for the bathroom. dirt's a little wet so it's hard to pack it without it sticking I got more dirt coming tomorrow though see every time I pack it it does this it's too wet So the kitchen is going to be a lot bigger, so I save space in here. Uh, I'm going to get just one water tank and put it in that corner, probably on this. And then I'm going to get uh, straw bales and go along the top here. And then I have all those window panes over there that I'm going to get. Um, that'll be like right here. So this is all window. So I, I know. I want to see all this from when I'm standing in the house, whether I'm in the kitchen area down here or I'm up here. I still want to be able to see all that. And then that mountaintop up there. This is a really nice view. Oh, Jesus.
going to build a first set of walls out of these. So in my head, without doing any research, which I will, I'm thinking I stack one at a time, take a couple pieces of rebar, go right into the straw bale. The bottom of the rebar will go into that tire and then this will go on top of the tire. Um, the rebar should be big enough to stick out so I can stack the next one, but before I stack the next one, I pull the plastic off and then get it like prepped. Actually, you know what? I have this stuff. Maybe even some of that steel. Maybe I can use some of that steel for the walls because this is the kitchen. So maybe um, as like a backsplash, I could use some of that tin. Oh, ow. And then in between the straw, I want to start cutting these wine bottles. Cut these and these and these ones. So these are like a dark, like a darker bottle. The green and this one and the white one. That would be like in between all the straw bales. Because the water is on that side, so that means the roof has to come down this way so that the rain goes into the gutter, which will go into the pipe, which will go into the water jugs, into the house. I'm just trying to fill in the back a little bit. So I'm gonna fill in all down here, make sure this is uh, real heavy and secure at the bottom. So these walls at the bottom here are at least four feet thick. Fill in all down here. All here will be full up against the tire. There'll be gravel and shit pushed up against it. Bottle wall here, straw bales along the back. I'm getting close to um, being finished this room. I just gotta put the roof on. <sighs> I... I think this rock is heavy enough to uh, keep this tire towards the front until I fill it back there. Then I can fill up this hole right here. So this cinder block was right there, but the space I was thinking would be better if I filled with one of these uh, tires that are just kind of like the shell. So I have a rock towards the front, keeping it um, over here as I fill it back there. And then when this, once this is full, it's gonna dip down a little bit, which is great. This will still be flush with this tire. So then I can start building uh, evenly this way because I have three more tires that are all the same size. So I can go from here all the way to here. And then um, right here, I was gonna put a, um, a little bottle wall. So that's the plan for today, so far. That'll probably change. So I'm pretty close to um, probably two more tires right there. 
to even that out. And then I got to fill in a couple tires up there. And then the top will all be done so I can start stacking the straw bales. And then a friend of mine is cutting bottles for me. So then I'll have those ready to do this area right here. And I'm thinking like this is a good spot for a little doorway. So maybe I can, um, I already have this tire that I put there for no reason whatsoever. So I might as well use it for something. Maybe I can put a door in here and go this way. So the straw bales are gonna set back a little bit. I'll have at least half of this tire. So maybe, um, maybe that's something to think about. Or I can um, just clear all this out and have the door be over there. I can enter through the pool area. So fancy. Whoa, what the fuck is that? So this is my idea for um, where the bedroom's going to be. I'm going to build a platform or observation deck so that this is my view from, uh, from my bedroom. And then I spent all this time digging this hole for water tanks. Um, it seems like such a waste. So now I'm thinking I'm going to do an indoor swimming pool. 